we had Ilyas question, can a Muslim take part in politics? So when we talk about politics, what is meant by politics? If you mean that the role that politicians take in order to legislate and to set the rules how the country is run in what they call democratic countries where you have the parliament, where you have the Senate, the Congress, whatever the names they have, this type of politics have good things. This type has good things and it has bad things. What concerns us as Muslims is that we can contribute in whatever does not contradict with our religion. So, for example, if you are a citizen in such countries and you can join while abiding by the Islamic rules and constantly being in contact with scholars, asking them about the permissibility of this act or that, in this case, this seems permissible, providing that you do not contribute to sin. So, to be a member of the parliament, you must not agree on something that is haram. If they're voting on legislating homosexuality, you definitely have to oppose that because it goes against your religion as a Christian, as a Jew, and you are a Muslim. It goes against your religion as a Muslim. The way that they are glorifying homosexuality is extremely offensive to people who worship Allah Azza wa Jal. And they're trying to push that down our throats in schools, in the media, in the society. And if you simply say that Islam prohibits it, immediately a red flag comes and says hate speech. What kind of hate speech? You're killing Muslims left, right and center. And there's no hate speech in that. When Muslims command goodness and virtue and ask people to be generous, to be kind, to be brave, to help one another, to feed the orphans, to take care of the widows, and to contribute for the welfare of the community, you turn a blind eye. And when we say that you have to stop the consumption of drugs and intoxicants, you have to stop looting and stealing and killing and abuse and harassment. And you don't even pay attention to that. Just when we talk about an aspect that Jews, Christians and Muslims agree upon, which is condemning homosexuality, you say that this is hate speech? You are hypocrites. Plain and simple. So... We have to make a stand. We have to say what we believe bravely and not beat around the bush. Do not be intimidated. If you become a politician in such a hostile environment and you manage to navigate through the enemies of what you believe and to say, with boldness and bravery, with truth, that this is what is right and this is what I fight for, it seems that this is permissible. And we have to look at the pros and cons of being a politician in such countries or such places, because usually speaking, politicians are the filthiest people around. They're compulsive liars, professional liars. They cheat, they embezzle, they get bribes like crazy. But 
every rule has exceptions and if you manage to be that exception then inshallah it is okay